What's good, good JD fam? fam? Welcome back to another live video. You did, did, dig. I had to put that in there. Yeah, you know everybody's what I'm saying? been so mad at you for not yeah, saying it. I'm sorry, guys. You know what I'm saying? I just I haven't really been saying it lately. <laughs> Somebody said, Why are you trying to act grown and not say it? I'm not trying to act grown. You know what I'm saying? I just ain't saying it. I just, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Today is going to be a nice little vlog for you guys. We are about to go get something to eat. Yep. Um, Yeah, it's like a little. Day brunch. It's currently 12 o'clock. We haven't eaten, so we're starving. And starving. babe, today I'm gonna let you choose the place. Babe, don't no, even listen. Do that. I'm gonna let you choose the place because no, don't no, even because do that. tomorrow we're going where I want to go, no questions asked. So you're gonna choose the place today because tomorrow I already know where we're going. Tomorrow. Okay, well, Portillo's. <laughs> well, there you go. Portillo's. <laughs> She's been <laughs> craving that. I've been wanting Portillo's and he hasn't taken me. And you guys, he didn't take me to Arby's either last time. Guys, we can go to Arby's anytime. <laughs> but really though, since I'm driving, you have to choose between two places. Julius, and I'm then, the wait, one who wait, gave wait, you listen. the two places. Wait, 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 wait. No, you have to choose between the old spaghetti factory. I'm the one who came up or the Morrison that you said. You guys, I literally narrowed it down for him to two different places and he still can't make a simple decision. <laughs> so I Guys, I'm driving, so that's even hard enough. I have to focus on the road, babe. I have to I have to like okay, so our understand choices... traffic signals and stuff. <laughs> our choices are this like American, like little like gastro pub type place that has like, you know, wings, burgers, like you know, all those little appetizers, everything like that. Or the old, old spaghetti, spaghetti factory, factory, which I've never pasta. been, but Julius, At the end, you get like, spumoni. I love Julius spumoni. has been talking about this darn restaurant since like the day I met him. Spumoni. And we've still never been. I've still never had it. Um, <laughs> and I know he really, really wants to go there, but he doesn't want to say. No, he I don't thinks care I'm gonna hate on it. <laughs> because it's it's Loki kind of further. But you know, I'm down for the drive because it is since I remember, but I know they okay, gave you spumoni. I mean, but babe, we, the way the other one's closer, we can eat quicker, and you know, what I'm saying they have a lot of good food. So, actually, we're gonna go to that place probably because you know, that's like sure? more. Yeah, I don't really want pasta early, okay? You know, it's kind of early, okay? Perfect. Our first, our first meal shouldn't be pasta, I feel like, yeah, that's more like a dinner place, yeah, huh? true. All right, so then I guess. The choice is made. We'll see you guys once we get to the restaurant. Let's do it. That was probably one of the best little meals we've had yeah. in a minute. That was so good, you guys. We literally ordered with our eyes. We got like everything we had. What did we get? We got I don't know. We got like chips. the whole menu. You guys are going to see all of it. it. Everything was so delicious. And then they brought out this amazing dessert to us at the end. It was it like was... bread pudding with ice cream and like this caramel sauce. Oh my gosh. Yes. I want to come back just for that. That thing yeah. is like delicious shout out to jamie and jessica they helped us out there and brought us that delicious dessert thank you so much and thank you we'll be coming back soon yes if you guys good. want to try a bomb dessert and some bomb food make sure you guys go to the morrison it's like in glendale las feliz area atwood uh, village yeah atwood <laughs> village the morrison atwood village <laughs> Make sure you guys go check it out. It's fire. So right now, we don't really know. What, what are we going to do, babe? We're going to go look at some furniture. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just like mm -hmm. handsome. Okay, we're going to make another baby. No. <laughs> well, maybe. Okay. So we have something that's coming up that you guys can't know yet. So it's kind of private. We're going to have to do this off camera. Yeah, we're basically going to go shopping. Let's yeah, just do that. We're going to go shopping. We're going to go shopping. And we're also going to talk to you guys about some things that I know a lot of you guys have been asking us. So we're gonna fill you in on all that. But right now, we're gonna head out 
and start driving because we need this AC to kick in. Cause AC I'm to real kick hot. in. It's a nice day. We about to listen to some music. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna see you guys a little bit later wherever we're at. And uh, yeah, just enjoy this vlog. It's gonna be fun. Okay, bye. All right, guys. So we officially made it home. It's a lot later in the day. There was a lot of traffic, so we were in traffic for a long time. But it feels good. I'm still full from earlier, and it's been hours. Yeah, it's been hours. We had to go run some errands, and she's still full. But you know, it's my little baby boy in there. He's growing. Well, he's extra big right now because I'm full. Oh my cool, goodness, but... babe, you are getting very, very yeah, pregnant. Yeah, you better watch to choose me. <laughs> hey, <laughs> Guys, I don't be trying to be rude, but she's getting big. And I don't be trying to say it in a rude way. I be trying you to like my belly's out. getting big. Yeah, but you know what I mean. No, he'll be like, you're getting huge. Because guys, it's crazy to me. I'll be like, whoa. I know. Like, that's insane. I wish I could show them my belly button. But oh my gosh, you guys. It's, it's like. Changing crazy. It's like popping out. And it's like every time I look at it, it's popped out more and more. I'm getting really scared. Yeah, she's on your trip every day. Like we was in the, where we were at, I was in the bathroom because my stomach started hurting. And I was taking number two. <laughs> he took two so, number two. Two number twos, guy. My, hey, my stomach <laughs> is on fire right now. But just know, she, when I was in the bathroom, she sent me a picture of her belly button. <laughs> For no reason, I'm like, Because I went what? to the bathroom too, number one, no, not no, number No, she two. went number two. No, you guys know number that. One. Number two. So, as you guys can see by the title, today we are going to be talking to you guys about a question that we've been getting asked for a All minute now. All the time, too. Ever since we got engaged and you guys found out that we were also expecting. Yay! You guys want to know if we're going to get married before the baby comes or after the baby comes. Ooh. <laughs> okay, babe. So go ahead. You can tell them, babe. Go ahead. Tell them. Tell them. Tell them. The answer is both. Both. <laughs> Ooh. So what we mean by both, babe, go ahead and tell them. Okay. So basically, I want to have like just a little, not even like a real wedding, but just like a super intimate thing with me and Julius. We're just going to like get married. I don't even know if we'll really tell you guys. I don't know if we'll tell them. It yeah, might just be something between know. us when we do it. But I do want to wear like a full beautiful wedding dress. So I might actually I might take them wedding dress shopping yeah, with me we, while I'm pregnant. We'll probably tell you guys when we, cute. when we do do it because you know what I'm saying. We want you guys to see us like when we all freshen up in our wedding dress, tuxedo and all that stuff. Yeah. But then once the baby comes, we want to have like our official actual real big wedding. It's not going to be big, but a destination wedding. Yeah. And we want the baby to be in the wedding. So we're going to wait for the baby to come to actually have like our full wedding ceremony and everything but we do plan on getting married just intimately before. and maybe yeah before and maybe we'll have like a dinner party with our Ooh, friends Ooh, nice <laughs> little oh we get married oh high five i thought no like <laughs> <laughs> I gotta switch hands because uh, this hand I think was it'll be tired. cool to be like a pregnant bride and then a non pregnant bride also. Yeah. I think that'll be cool. So, there you guys have it. We are going to be getting married, just not having an official. When do you want to marry me? Whenever you want to, babe. <laughs> but we ain't gonna be having no official wedding yet until baby Brown is here. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that's kind of selfish of us to do that because. He's right around our the corner. Baby, we might as well wait. Yeah, our baby needs to be there. Our baby needs to, you know what I'm saying, witness. He's going to be the ring bearer. Beautiful moment. Yes. He's going to be the ring bearer. And he's going to be a little cute baby in his nice little tuxedo <laughs> looking like his daddy. Oh, so that's our plan, guys. Hopefully you guys like it, you know what I'm saying? But we are going to have to start going like wedding we go, shopping I want to go wedding dress shopping before I get too, too big. Yeah, we're going to have to do that pretty soon, babe. If you want to like go ahead and go do something soon. <laughs> well, you guys stay tuned for that because it's going to be fun. And I think for that, the, like the wedding dress that I'm going to wear for this wedding that's you know, coming up soon where I'm pregnant, you mm -hmm. can help me pick out the dress. Just okay. the one with the actual Ooh, ceremony, you can't be there. Okay, okay. You or do you want it to be a surprise? Tuxedo. Nah, no surprise on this one. For the actual wedding, it would be a surprise. Okay. <laughs> and then you can help me pick out my tuxedo. We hope you guys are super, super excited because we have a lot of fun things that are coming up. Like, no lie, this is just one of the big fun things that we are going to be getting married. Like, an actual... You know what I'm saying? Married couple. What? Very, You're very gonna soon. Be my husband. I'm going to be her <laughs> husband. She's going to be my wife, and we're going to have a nice little cute son. Get it? 
And we also have a lot more fun stuff coming up. So hopefully you guys stay tuned. And uh, my arm's getting tired. And I need to go upstairs and use the bathroom again. Oh my so god. So we're going to check in with you guys a little bit later. We don't know what we're doing for the rest of the day. But we're going to figure it out. So we'll see you guys later. Alright guys. It's way later on in the night. My allergies are going crazy right now. Um, we actually just ordered some pizza. I don't know what's in the background. So I didn't order that. Destiny ordered that and she said she wasn't getting none. So surprise. You know what I'm saying? And me. Let's see what I. Ooh! That right there. I don't care what anybody says. I know you guys are going to be commenting like, ugh, who gets pineapple on their pizza? I do. And Baby Brown is going to be loving pineapple on his pizza, so don't be hating. Don't be commenting no, no negative stuff because it's fire. But we really ain't doing nothing for the rest of the night. You know what I'm saying? We're probably going to eat, probably turn on a movie, and we probably just going to go to sleep. Probably I'm probably going to end up falling asleep during the movie, and Destiny probably going to get mad, but it's all good. Tomorrow we have a long day because we have some big, big plans. And you know what I'm saying? We need some rest. So we'll see you guys in our next video. We love you guys so much. And thank you guys for watching. Peace.